imported products are dangerous in households with children and pets. The Window Covering Safety Council urges you to make the right choice and select a cordless product. Wood and faux wood blinds are beautiful and easy to install. In this video, we'll show you how to mount a wood or faux wood blind inside your window frame step by step. First, take a look at the installation guide that was included with your blind. Make sure you have all of the parts and all of the tools you'll need. And if you're installing into anything other than wood, use the appropriate screws and anchors. First, mark the location of each bracket, making sure both are installed at the same depth in the window. Next, hold each bracket up to the marks and mark the screw locations. Now drill the holes for the screws with a 1 16th inch drill bit and screw the bracket securely into place. Next, attach the valance clips. Now slide the headrail into the brackets and close the bracket doors until you hear them snap into place. Next, install the valance slides and then line them up and slide them onto the clips to attach the valance to the headrail. And attach the cord cleats 6 to 12 inches apart at a height that's out of reach of children. Wrap the cords around the cleats in a figure 8 when not in use. This will create a safer environment for kids and pets if used correctly and consistently. To lower your blind, pull the lift cords toward the center of the window, then pull the lift cords toward the edge of the window to lock the blind into place. To raise your blind, pull the lift cords toward the outside of your window and lock into place. And remember, always raise and lower your blind with the slats in the open position. That's it! You're done! If you had any trouble following these steps, or need to know how to care for and clean your new blind, check your installation guide or visit our website. The Window Covering Safety Council recommends cordless window coverings that are certified best for kids.